Hello there, nice people. Hope you are doing well. Thank you so much for stopping by. Nuno here once again. So today, on the 19th of December, Apple released the beta 2 of the 10.14.3 and the build number uh, for this release is the 18D. 3 to a the specs of the machine are here you can pause it in order to compare to the synthetic benchmarks that i will show you and also guys i wasn't able to take the screenshot of the of the download but on this machine it was about 1.6 gigabytes okay so according to apple uh, this is only bug fixes and performance improvements and also of course I will go through with all the bugs that I had on the previous betas but let's go ahead without further ado first with the synthetic uh, benchmarks this was regarding the beta 1 okay and this is the beta 2 it has a small decrease but again Keep in mind, this is just, you know, about one hour after the installation. These results will probably increase. Okay, guys, so this is the Geekbench for this um, release. And regarding the GPU performance with Metal on the first beta, it was, the, the results were this and on this one, this beta 2. Uh, a small decrease but then again let's wait a few hours or 24 hours to see the you know results then again guys keep in mind these are only synthetic benchmarks what counts is the real world usage now many of us are complaining about the highlights on the pdfs uh, since the release of macOS Mojave final build and after all these betas now we are on 10.14.3 the issue still remains so the highlight the color of the highlight is still too dark in order for us you know to see properly and even when making a presentation or whatever you know uh, or a screencast like I'm doing it is you know not good not good not not good at all so it is <laughs> they have to you know put a bright color but all all the the threads are pointing to this but they haven't fixed it yet now i haven't on the previous beta had any issues but uh, the one that i like to focus is the youtube uh, lay the new youtube layout that you know doesn't work well on safari let's go ahead let's go to my channel in order not to have any copyright issues here and let's go to my channel let's go here let's put let's mute this let's go to my videos let's go to the last one since i just released you know just half an hour ago um, the new ios 12.1.3 beta 2 and uh, let's go ahead and check if the issue still remains so let's put it large let's go to full screen and if i go again and want to go to the as you can see the issue still remains so a big mess uh, everything i know it's not only uh, on my system many of you have comment that you have the same issue here as you can see big big mess if you want you have to refresh the page in order for everything to be fixed again so apple haven't addressed the issue uh, with youtube uh, with the new youtube layout uh, on safari it is working well on chrome and also on opera uh, these are the two uh, secondary web browsers that i use okay so but the new youtube layout works well on these two uh, web browsers but on safari once again it's not working probably i don't know uh, properly sorry i don't know if it is a problem of safari of or if it is you know uh, google that you know is not uh, willing to put youtube were working in a nice uh, way on safari so these issues still remain the pdf and also the safari bug uh, again if i go here and uh, want to scroll you know there is a little bit of a stutter and yes it's still present when the the page it's render it's as you can see 
lots of lag and afterwards everything still seems to be okay so this issue still remains and it is not present on chrome google chrome uh, everything is very very smooth again guys there isn't anything new this is only uh, you know bug fixes but as you as like i see the bugs still remain and performance so um let's wait of course 24 hours let's see the speed test on this on this disc but uh, keep in mind i'm recording so uh it will be it's not yeah i'm re i'm screen recording for so it the the speeds will not be the same well that's i i also like to focus here on the previous uh, build i had something my fans were uh, always kicking uh, as you can see here on the top right corner i have this app and uh, you know the temperature now it's okay the fans are not kicking on the previous build they were kicking even when watching youtube videos now everything seems to be okay the ram usage uh, it's about six gigs of the nine available it's higher than you know the 10.14.2 so I had this issue with high RAM usage on the 10.14.3, the beta 1 and beta 2, so this still remains. Um, I have, I'm using 4 or 5% of the CPU, this is uh, on par with the 10.14.2 and also with the beta 1. Um, and uh, again, uh, I'll, for you guys that uh, uh, like, you know, uh, always to know about the better usage, uh, I know I'm, I'm repeating myself for my subscribers, but then again, there are also new people arriving to the channel and I appreciate that. So this is a three-year-old machine with only now it has 36 cycles. So I tested the battery uh, on the beta one and everything. Uh, it was, it had uh, 35 cycles, I believe. Now it has 36 uh, and, uh, you know, it was as expected, you know, um, about six hours of usage and I didn't drain the battery completely, but uh, I was able to use about six hours on this MacBook Pro 15 inch. And uh, again, as you can see, the current capacity is still higher than the design capacity. So, and as you can see the manufacturer date, this is a mid 2015 MacBook Pro. So guys, this is what I have to show you. Um, thank you so much for stopping by. Put your comments below. What are the issues that you are having? Let's make here a thread and a good conversation. Keep safe and I hope to see you in the next one. Bye-bye.